That is like I, maybe he just I just kind of too suspicious here, but it, it felt strange. It felt, it felt quite strange. Not gonna lie. Okay, well I do here because this is a stress comp, right? This is a stress comp. So I actually before he stuns my abomination, I go first. So before he stuns me, I'll just drop my I'll just drop uh, my my abom to to the beast form. So he doesn't get the stun off instantaneously because he's probably gonna stun the abomination here. Oh, we get like very very beautiful amount of stress across the board as well. That's gorgeous. Grunge Bay 666 mate, welcome to the dungeon, welcome. Guys, if you're new to the stream, remember to subscribe because you allow me to keep growing this way. Like every single subscription means I can actually keep growing my channel. It's, it's huge for me, it's absolutely huge for me. Wait, that, does he just give, is this a stress? No, it's, a, it's not a stress, it's a repose comp, isn't it? It's like repose there's damage composition. Oh, I, I did disable the sound, yeah, sorry. It's, it's back up, it's back up. He uses guard dog here, so... And we can play this slow, we can just stack regions here like this, this vial here, so I just don't have to play this forward at all. It's okay. I can just do this stress over time and, and be fine with this. I can just do stress over time and be, f and be fine with this for sure. Now uh, we dodge as well, that's very lucky for me that we dodged this actually. Screw it, it's like, I'm not gonna play, I can play my slow stress game because I have the Abomination, so it's whatever, like, whatever he does, I can still just, you know, slowly, slowly play into this. And he has Repose, so I just don't want to trigger his Repose too much, I think that's okay. We just debuff him hard. There's no way of removing the debuffs other than the Rally to Flame from the Crusader. So it's minus 40, minus 40 damage across the board already, so those Repose will just do significantly less over time. And there will be a breaking point where I can actually start spamming out the stress kills, right, that's the, that's the idea here anyway. Because I don't care about his bellows that much. And he should care about my stuff, right? He should, probably, he should probably care about my stuff. So what we do here is we basically just go back to the human form now. We drop the we drop the beast spile, because we can do it now. We take the repose for this, that doesn't hurt that much. And next time we just go back to the to the beast form again. So we get like another stack of horror across the board. He can't remove horror with these guys. So just passively stress him to, to the breaking point. He has like no real way of stress removal here. So all those repose, like he has one repose here actually. I think I can just go for it with the uh, with the antiquarian as well. So we just drop festering vapors. Hopefully he doesn't repose for too much. Okay, he doesn't repose for anything. So every little bit matters here right now. So we just kind of start stacking this stuff. Uh, I can probably count, I can do the rush with the Houndmaster as well, I suppose. He does, he actually goes for this, so he gets reposted, he dodges as well. Okay, cool. That's fine. That's okay, he, look, look at how little damage he's doing right now. It's okay, but I, I like the Abomination because there's like a lot of passive stress. Why does he heal this? So he tries to remove the, the debuff, but he should be healing the, the Highwayman if anything, I feel. He, sh he should just be healing the Highwayman here. Because the Highwayman is his core reposed character. He's like minus 60% right now. And stacking, right? And stacking. He hasn't, exact he hasn't exactly accomplished much this game. That's the thing, right? He hasn't ac exactly accomplished much here. Minus 60% isn't scary at all. It's just 11 damage, yeah, that's fine. Highman is okay, that's exactly what I would say. He's just okay. That's perfectly, that basically just describes what, what, what he is. Like one to one. Okay, he actually stuns me, shit. So I can't transform yet. Can, however, just do some bleed here, and I'm just gonna do this because this is like pressure on the Crusader now to start healing, right? That's, that's very nice for me. 
like all the AOE I'm doing is also like a potential execute for me, so that's also very, very nice. He has to keep up the repose every turn. Oh, he doesn't actually. He loses the repose now, doesn't he? I think he loses the repose this way. When he does this, he loses the repose. Okay, I just I'm gonna go first next turn. Just gonna transform to beast mode and rake his front line if I if I can. That's nice for me as well. That stun doesn't quite do much. Oh, we, he misses and I dodge a lot because like Hound's here is very low accuracy. In fact, obviously like this was kind of unwarranted. I feel. Yeah, let's just go. Let's let's just deal more horror to him. That's a lot of stress across the board, guys. It's like so much stress across the board, actually. Oh, he's vigorous. Fuck! It's obviously not what, what I was looking for. It's uh, the opposite of what I was looking for. Yeah, he's slowly dropping down, but it's okay. Because he has to repose now, I guess. I, I can just start stacking heals, right? I can just do single target. Uh... Oh my god, he actually crits this. He actually crits this. Okay, that's fine. Because of how much horror he has across the board, I think this is okay still. This is still okay. Because he in Holy Lance now, I guess he's just gonna Holy Lance me or something. I can just pop for, pop the region now and that's gonna be still fine. He didn't do the damage either, so that's okay still. So just wait for the damage to come through and then I just I just activate the Houndmaster and just heal. As long as he's not courageous, that's not so terrible, right? As long as he's not courageous, that's not bad. He's at death's door as well, so that's that's fine. So he's constantly under pressure now. He's constantly going to be under pressure. Plus I have no reason to be healing this. I can just start stacking my... Uh, keep stacking the bleeds and keep attacking this this guy here. Because I had like a lead in terms of stress, despite the fact that I didn't bolster on first turn, I just didn't bolster on first turn. Which I probably should have done honestly, like from the... From the... I think it would be reasonable to just bolster on first turn there, but yeah. I'm gonna drop some rest restoration still so that I can kind of keep up the HP on the Houndmaster so that he can actually keep doing what he's doing best. And yeah, so I don't die to some random reposts. So I have to just play this careful. I think it's gonna be I'm gonna be okay then. Oh my god, he does eight damage actually. Shit. A hand breadth from becoming unwound. No, Basil, Basil tests for masochistic shit. Basil, no, irrational shit. Okay, that's okay because if he just goes back to, I would have gone to human form again anyway. So that's okay. That's fine. We just need to bleed. Like I think if we just spread damage a bit, okay. Come, come on, guys. Though, he's 35% bleed resistance. I might be playing this too slow. I think I might be playing this a bit too slow though, because he just might win this. He's taking over with the stress damage, and I haven't quite broken anybody yet. That's the problem. He has broken two characters of mine, three now, and I just yeah, I haven't broken anyone. So I might be like too late to the party now because of those heals. Those it might be too late. Injury, find it in no short supply. Might be sort of late to the party here, not gonna lie. So we get like a single stress out character here. The second one potentially on the way, but let's, this might not be enough. Yeah, he does more stress for sure. So that, let's just see how this pans out now, because I do have like a lot of regions stack. I think I, I can just go a bit all in right now and just see where it takes me. Ninety-one, ninety-nine. He's like about to br to break as well across the board, so it's, that's kind of fine. And obviously, I think he relies on damage way more than I do, so... Now everybody breaks, so you have like, no, three broken characters now only. In fact, I thought, the, thought this was gonna be four, actually. Fear and frailty. This is gonna be a close fight, actually, it's gonna be a close fight. Now, that's my mistake for not using Bolster first turn, I think. I should have just used Bolster first turn. But yeah, he's not using the Crusader at all. That's the thing. Like he's not able to use the Crusader too much because he's always just uh, in a very, very low HP state uh, for this fight's duration, right? So that's the, that's the nice part of this. So 
So you break his men at arms as well. So now it's gonna be like the game of afflictions for you. That's just gonna be the game of afflictions. Frustration and fury. I think it's like a little bit more total stress than me, right? Because my antiquarian is still off of the of the affliction here. Hey, that's that's good for him actually, because the crusader can stun me if he wants to now. Oh god. He's gonna be taking some stress now as well. The question is like, do I just risk losing the Houndmaster already? I think I don't. I think I don't lose. Like, I don't want to risk losing the Houndmaster yet. Just yet anyway, right? So we just... The problem is I, I kind of encounter, like, I can't be using the Houndmaster indefinitely. So I, I have to just kind of try to sacrifice him at some point, I think. I have to just try to sacrifice him at some point. Because I need to be doing this AoE stress. Okay, he takes another one, so he, he takes a lot of repose here from the uh, from the abomination. It's obviously very good for me. Oh, he he didn't have the repose. Fuck, he didn't have the repose. I missed it. Completely missed that one. I didn't see that he had no repose. In fact, I didn't see that he had no repose at all. Okay. He might lose the Crusader very soon, actually. He might just lose the Crusader very, very soon here. Confusion, nerves, and panic. Precision and power. Oh, that's bad, actually. That's so bad. Because this heart attack just comes a little bit too soon. Fuck. Because I was hoping he would go to zero and just take stress and die, but this just didn't happen now. Fuck. That's bad for me. That's very bad for me, actually. But he has to heal this now, right? He has to heal this. Oh, he heals from... F oh, God, he gets the free Vigorous heal. Not Gucci, not Gucci. I, I, I think I have to go all in with that stress now. I just have to go all in with the stress. Okay, he, he might lose the Antiquarian for this. Oh, we take, we take a heart attack, though. But it's never good, is it? It's never good. We have six... Re I, I'm just gonna activate him and drop more stress. Because I need to heal him like as soon as I can, right? That's the, that's the important part ends. here. Terrible vistas of emptiness reveal themselves. Uh, I think he's gonna win this. I, I haven't done enough stress damage at all. Please don't heal, though. please don't heal. Okay, he actually... Oh, he, goes, he kills two characters now. Fuck, he gets two kills now. And now the true test. Oh no. Hold fast. Oh no, we lose this now. Expire. Ah, fuck. That's, I just played this too slow, I think. I just played this too slow. Oh, we get a heart attack as well, at least one then, so that's fine. It is Crusader stayed in the game a bit too long because of that. Yeah, I, I know, I know, I know, I know. I probably should have been doing more stress damage, should have been playing this a bit more risky than I was. I mean, there's still hope, like, as long as there are afflictions, there is hope, guys. He's, like, at a, at a very, very high stress as well. He has no reliable way of reaching my backline either. So that's, that's another nice thing. He has no reliable way of reaching the backline here. And my Antiquarian isn't even like isn't even stressed yet, so. Masterfully executed. Okay, so there's a heart attack. Man, he might actually still lose this, in fact. We'll see. Yeah, the Crusader MVP is actually the that that that's basically what saves his game, I think. Does he get enough damage? Mortality clarified no, he doesn't. He doesn't. He doesn't. Oh, he does get enough damage. Actually, he does get enough stress. Do something. Why are where are the afflictions when you need them? Where are the afflictions when you need them? Come on. Oh, but he ret why? Why didn't he bellow? He had to bellow. Why didn't he bellow this? Hol holy crap! Why didn't he bellow this? Oh, he killed himself as well. Fuck! He killed himself. Holy shit, he killed himself. That's a highlight as well. Oh, this is... Th that's so funny. Oh, I had a way back into this. I was gonna kill two characters there, but he just killed himself. That's F. That's F material. Oh, no. he He's gonna heal now. He's gonna heal now, and I'm gonna lose this. He Why does he use guard dog? Why does he use guard dog here? What is he doing? Why does he guard dog? He loses this. He loses this now, actually. He might lose this still. 
Oh no, he dodges! On both characters, actually. He dodges on both. Rip. Ladies and gentlemen, that's a rip. Okay, he can't he can't target me for a while. That's nice. I can just kind of you know do my thing from 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 very far away. That's that's good. <gasps> oh god, he he resists the stun. Twenty five percent chance to resist. And he resists it. That's so funny. Yeah, I'm, I'm out of like please. Oh no, come on. Because they are both dead if they take damage now. They're, because he he dies from from heart attack and then he just kind of channels this onto the onto the hammer. So he's like he has 42 dodge though, so it's like likely that he does. Oh no, no! She acts out of turn. Come on! Oh no, that's terrible for me. That's like such bad news for me actually. Holy fuck! Oh god. Okay, good, good, good. One heart attack. I think I got this. I think I got this, actually, guys. I think I have, I have this. We still win this. Unless I get some very unlucky unlucky stuff from my from my antiquary. I think I still get this. Because he has taken so much, actually. He has taken so much stress, anyway. So he has to just keep using Hans Harry now. I think he loses this still. Um, it's mathematically likely that he loses this before I lose this for myself. I think that's how it goes, seriously, because, like, he can't reach, that's the nice part about the Antiquarian, you just can't reach her, you can't reach the Antiquarian at all. He has, like, two characters at Death's Duel. Now he dodges again on the Houndmaster, though, shit. Yeah, he messed up a ton, indeed. So he deserves to lose this, seriously, but, okay. Ah. A little bit more stress. 185 guys, 185. He takes a single, he takes a single shot now and he's really screwed. Okay, he, he heals, okay, that's reasonable. Finally he heals, actually. He should have died here though, he should have fucking died here, I swear. See, he has to keep bellowing this, right? He just has to keep bellowing this. Because he wins with stress, he wins with stress if he just keeps bellowing, he wins with stress eventually. I dodge again though, I dodge again. So oh my god. Is a tenuous proposition in this sprawling tomb. That's gonna be super close, yes, indeed. It's gonna be super close. He has to keep stressing me, that's the only way he can win this. If he just keeps stressing me all the time. Oh wait, dodge again! My god, this is the luckiest Articuarian ever. Oh, he has the worst affliction though. Yeah, yeah, okay, another dodge! She's like divine at those dodges, like she's so good at those dodges, seriously. Maybe I should have dropped the region though. I should have probably dropped the region somewhere across the... Like, somewhere along the way. I mean, I'm gonna have enough on him so that he can't, like, heal, regenerate, right? He can't regenerate anymore. Yeah, just that he has... Uh, he has no longer... He no, no, nah, he no longer has high dodge right now. He no longer has high dodge. He has such a troll build as well. Oh, shit. Crit. Hurts, 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 hurts. I have faulty dodge to his, whatever. He can't lay coons anymore. So it's just, it's just, oh, we dodge. Okay, I think we win this then, we just win this. A devastating blow. Four more stress, guys, four more stress and we win. That's also super, super close, yeah. Oh yes, God! This antiquarian is like, she's the, she's divine. She's fucking divine, guys. Oh she, oh no, she stealths out of turn. She stealths out of turn. Shit. Yeah. Can he target me? I didn't do this. It just, it just happened. She, she acted out of turn. 
He can heal though. He can heal from second position though. I get rid of the corpse now though. I get. Please don't do anything stupid. Okay, now it's win. GG. GG. Well played. Continue oh, that, that was like a really beautiful game, guys. Them. This oh. antiquarian. Holy crap, this antiquarian, seriously. Oh, that was something. That was a thing of beauty. That was a thing of beauty, guys. She deserves a medal. She deserves a medal. 248.